This is a short video showing how to use the photo gates within SparkView. First, connect your digital adapter to your interface. Once you've done that, a dialog box will appear that to assign the digital adapter. In this case, we're going to select Collision Timer and then select OK. Once you've done that, you'll be asked to assign the flag length. You'll measure that from the flag that is on your cart or on your glider and then go down and select OK. Next, we're going to build a page. We'll do that by selecting the page with the starburst at the top of the page. We're going to now select the largest template on the upper right hand side and we're going to select a table. The initial displays on the table are the time of the collision and then an unconfigured column. We're first going to select the time column and we're going to reassign this by selecting the measurement button and clicking on where it says time. And then from the right hand side we're going to select the velocity 1. Then we can select the second column by selecting the top here and selecting column 2. Once we've done that we'll select the measurement button and we'll select velocity 2. Once I select that and click OK I now have a table that is ready to report out the velocity in photo gate 1 and the velocity in photo gate 2. 